Hi, I'm Amber Marsala with SCN Corporate Connect. We're here today at the Coin Agenda Summit at Caesars Palace in Las Vegas. I'm here now with Halsey Miner from VideoCoin. So tell me a little bit about your company. Yeah, so we're a utility token and what we do is we allow resources to be harnessed, computing resources to be harnessed across the internet to, uh, to do the critical things that are needed in video like, uh, like coding, storage, distribution. The internet's now about 80% video traffic. Yep. Um, we have people like uh, who are part of our organization, uh, part of our, our effort like uh, Hanno Basse, who's the CTO of 20th Century Fox, because media companies are getting killed by the, by the rapid increase in online video as opposed to broadcast. Um, and so the primary benefit that we have using the blockchain to use all of these uh, computing resources um, is we reduce the cost of Amazon Web Services video, it's a big chunk of, of, of what they do, by about 60 to 80 percent. So that's a wow. huge thing for media companies yeah. all, all around the world. Wow. So is that how you're utilizing the blockchain technology? Yeah. So what we're doing, yeah. So exactly. So I was one of the original founders of Salesforce.com, which was a, which was a complete change in architecture from client server at the time. And the blockchain is the next evolution of the cloud because instead of having to own everything in one data center, you now can use resources from everywhere, and many of those are far cheaper. Right. Um, you know, the model of, of Bitcoin. Uh, is you have to have the cheapest source of power to be profitable. Mm -hmm. So that's a complete commodification of, comp of computing. Right. And so that's what's happening. You know, a lot of people think Amazon Web Services lasts forever. Um, well, this is the Salesforce to, to Oracle and Siebel of its day. Just starting, I don't think Amazon, anybody has to worry about Amazon this year, yeah. but, uh, but three years from now, it's, uh, it's going to be a legitimate challenger, much lower cost, actually more innovation. Wow. So how long have you been in the space and how did you originally get involved? So I've actually been in the space a fairly long time. Um, I think I sort of got interested when Bitcoin was around 10. Uh, I actually launched a company, uh, a very important company in the industry in 2013 that, um, um, like Coinbase, is one of the few services that provides access to buying cryptocurrencies that allow you to connect your US and European bank accounts. Oh, wow. That's a, that we, in order for us to do that, because uh, nobody will bank crypto we had to buy part of the U.S. bank. Wow. Um, um, Coinbase was very lucky. They got Silicon Valley Bank to agree to bank them. Right. Uh, really nobody else can get it. So there's a very small aperture through which money can get in and buy these. Coinbase is one path, Uphold is, is another path. So, so that the prop was the problem I originally tried to solve for people is how do you get access to these, uh, to these, to these opportunities to, to own these crypto assets. Um, and, and, and did that very successfully. And, um, um, and then really now I'm trying to use the architecture of the blockchain um, to create a new architecture for, for computing that's, that's, much, much, that's much cheaper. Nice. So can you talk about your upcoming ICO? Yeah, so we're in the private sale phase. Um, if we actually do the public ICO, probably would be in late March. Um, we're, we've capped it at $50 million. We're, we, we, um, uh, our goal is not to raise the most amount of money. The goal is to, um, is to right, bring the right people into our ecosystem. Um, and uh, we have, um, the team we have is incredibly uh, accomplished. Uh, my CTO built Intel's video streaming cloud uh, around their data center and um, Intel sold it to Facebook. And if people remember a day when video showed up in Facebook, it's because they bought his, uh, they built, they bought what he built. Um, so yeah, so we have, and many of the um, people we have are, are people from Intel who have uh, who have uh, specialties uh, building you know very complex uh, uh, video-based technologies? So yeah, so we've got you know one of the strongest teams in video period, mm -hmm. um, and somebody who's probably the only person who's actually built a video cloud in the last you know ten years. I mean, really? Amazon's been around for a while. Yeah. Wow. So so yeah. So and it's just we're just approaching it with a completely new architecture and. Um, um, and the, and the blockchain enables it because it allows these resources to be harnessed to prove they did something and then to compensate them when they did. Okay. And the world of fiat doesn't work for that, yeah. but smart money, you know, which is really what this is all about, mm -hmm. allows for you know, people to contribute. Um, you know, we're just creating computing as a commodity. Okay. You know, so 
Airbnb has homes as a, as cars as a commodity. I'm sorry, homes as a commodity. Uber has cars as a commodity, and we're just creating computation as a commodity. That's great. Well, it sounds wonderful. Thank you so much for talking with us. Yeah, Bobby. well, thank you. Great. I'm Amber Marsala, and you're watching SCN Corporate Connect.